Well, it's December 30th and I'm in my backyard in Muskoka. We've got about a foot and a half of snow back here and uh, it's just starting to rain. The snow is perfect for packing and uh, I'm gonna make something in the snow. I've been wanting to do this for a while, so hopefully it works out. Let's uh, see how it goes. All right, so here I've got my canoe kind of shaped out. I still need to do like all the, you know, actual shaping, but just like lump the snow. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be a canoe, in case you didn't know. It's not gonna be the full length 15 feet like the one I have is, um, the H2O Pro Light, but uh, maybe a pack boat. It looks maybe about 12 feet. <laughs> and over here, I figured if I'm gonna have my canoe, I might as well have my tent too. So um, I'm gonna keep working on these and uh, I'll come back in a bit and show you how I'm doing. All right, well, it started to get dark. Um, I've got a spotlight on in the kitchen window. It would probably be better actually in the bedroom window, um, but it's lighting up the area enough so I can keep working and uh, the conditions are perfect. So I've almost got the tent done and uh, it's looking pretty good. And I'm gonna move on to the canoe next. All right, I haven't done much with the canoe. I just kind of shaped it and then I kind of got excited about the tent. So I started working on that. Um, I've got it pretty much almost the right shape. Uh, as you can see, I got the vestibule um, piece out here on the fly, um, and then that part is open. Uh, and then uh, I just got to do some more work on it and shape it and stuff. But uh, I'm going to go back to working on the canoe right now. Well, it's about 6 o'clock. Um, I think I started around 3.30, 4 o'clock. Um, just finished this side of the canoe. Looks pretty good so far. Just like uh, making all the edges nice and crisp and um, smoothing it out. And it's nice and warm out. Well, it's not warm, but it's only about two degrees, so minus two. So it's really pleasant out. I'm not cold at all. and. Uh, I'm having a lot of fun, so I'm gonna keep going. All right, it is 6.30. Feels like it's 10 o'clock at night. Um, canoe's looking pretty good, I think. I gotta thin it out a bit. I'm just starting to uh, take out the middle. I made the seat. And uh, I wasn't actually gonna clear the snow out of it, but I think I'm gonna give it a go, at least some of it. Alright, it's 7.30 and uh, it's starting to rain out here pretty good. Um, starting to get cold. I just put the logo in on the side. I don't know if you can see it. There you go. <laughs> and uh, I was trying to smooth out that side over there and I knocked off the whole front. So I just had to fix it all. There's the other side. <laughs> I do have... Um, some green coloring to put on it, but I don't know what's gonna happen with the rain and the snow tonight. All right, and then here's the tent. 
Hopefully it'll still be here tomorrow. I didn't even get to smooth the tent or finish it off or anything, so hopefully I can finish it tomorrow. Oh, now it's like hailing on me. <laughs> okay, I think it's time to go. It's about 8.30 and it's pouring rain. Um, I'm soaking wet, my hands are soaking wet. I'm still warm. Uh, canoe's done, tent's all done, and uh, feeling pretty good. Hopefully I can work on it a little bit more tomorrow. Um, the weather doesn't wreck it, but I'm still pretty happy with uh, how it turned out. All right, well, it is day two of my playing in the snow, snow sculpture building thing, and um, everything looks good. There was a, a dusting of snow last night, so the canoe and the tent are both covered a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna work on smoothing out the tent and doing some more details on that, and um, then I have the coloring ready to go, so that's gonna be really cool. I found something that seems to work really well. Um, I was using some food coloring and some water, but it didn't come out good. It looks yellow. Um, so I have some um, dish soap, green dish soap, and it's environmentally friendly, so it should be fine to use. And um, it looks like it makes a nice green. I've been spraying it outside my, my back door, of all kinds of different colors. Um, I also have a little black, and I did a stencil uh, to make the logo on the tent, and uh, I'll fill in the H2 logo on the canoe. Well, I was thinking last night that this was actually my campsite. I would definitely need a fire pit. So uh, the snow is horrible to work with today. So I'm glad I did what I did last night and stayed up and stayed out. Um, now it's all ice on the top. So what I did was I cut out rocks <laughs> to make the fire pit. And uh, I generally like a uh, three-sided fire pit, but it just looked better for the effect on this. Well, it's about noon on New Year's Eve day, and uh, I think I'm pretty much done. Um, got the fire pit all set up here. Just made a little snow chair there. You can't see it very well. I didn't color it. Um, got my tent there. Uh, I put the Eureka exclamation mark symbol on there, but um, it ran, and then I fixed it, and then it ran again, so I'm just going to leave it. And uh, there's the canoe. Camp in your backyard, they said. Okay. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like what you saw, please click the subscribe button. Also click the bell for notifications. If you'd like to get more information on the stuff I use on my trips, please check out my website at campercristina.com. Thanks. Bye.